what is up guys welcome and welcome back to my channel um today's video i'm gonna show you guys how to cartoon yourself using pixel app application interestingly pixel app is mostly used for logos flyers and other stuff but today i'm gonna show you guys how to actually just easily cartoon yourself using pixel app so if you're really interested in learning this make sure to give this video a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel that's if you're new here so without wasting you guys time let's jump right into today's tutorial all right so once we've opened the application the first thing we're going to do is to import the picture we are cartooning so i'm just going to come over here and i'm going to go to import then i'm just going to quickly import the picture i want to use so i'm going to go on and uh, so i click ok and then we bring it over here so i'm just going to increase the size a little like that and then i'm just going to put it in the middle okay great so now that we've done that, what I want to do, what I want you to do is come over here and then lock, okay, lock the picture so it doesn't move as we are editing. So for the new test, we don't need it. So I'm just going to click on delete. Okay. And then we have that. So now what we're going to do now is come over to draw. That's this tool called draw. And then I'm going to be using black to do the outlining. Okay. So I'm going to click on black. And then once i click on that i'm just going to reduce the pen size i'm going to reduce it to about four yeah then i click on this zoom over here that's the zoom icon then i'm just going to zoom it like that okay so now that i have that i'm just going to start outlining so i'm to start outlining, i'm going to click on the zoom icon again then i'm just going to start doing what i want to do so like this Okay, I think the pen size is too much. I'm going to reduce it a little again to about three. Okay. So basically that's what I'm just going to be doing. I'm just going to be outlining it. So um, not to bore you guys, I'm just going to like increase the speed of the video. So um, I'll see you guys later. All right, um, so once you have finally done everything for me, I'm done. So once I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna click on the check mark, which is okay, which is over here. All right, once I've done that, then let's click on the zoom icon again. Then once I've done that, I'm gonna click on here and I'm gonna take this down, like tap on it and bring it down. So now if we click on this icon over here, you will see what we just did. So this is what we did and then so you can just take this back okay so now once you've done that let's take it back up again so you can see what you just did so now once you've done that the next we're going to do now is coloring we want to color the eyebrow the eye the the teeth the lips and then the earring and other stuff so um for that what we're going to do is we're going to come back here go back to draw okay so now we're going to click on this plus icon which is over here you can see it i'm going to click on it then once I click on it, I'm going to click on this color picker icon over here. So yeah, I'm just going to click here. Then, 
so the first thing we're going to start with is the, is the air so the air is naturally black so we don't really need to um pick the color but let's just do it for plain sake okay so it's black so i'm going to click on okay and i'm going to click on okay over here okay now once you've done that so now i'm just going to start coloring the hair step by step so yeah okay that's the size is too much i'm going to reduce the size a little and then um, one thing about this thing is if you do it carefully it will come out way. but if you wash and just do it anyhow it's not going to come out way the way you want it so um yeah let me quickly just color the hair and then i'll get back to you guys All right, so now that we've done that, um, since we're also going to be using color black for the eye and then for the beers, let's just do that also, okay? So I'm just going to quickly color the eye also. Okay, so same thing goes for the beers also. We're going to just quickly color the beers and then, um, yeah. remember make sure to do it step by step don't wash okay so now that we've done that i'm just going to zoom out all right then once i've done that i'm going to click on the zoom icon again then i'm going to click on okay okay now that we've done that so i'm going to take it down like that so um what i want you to do now is to click on here to see the the work you've been doing so now you notice that some space there's some space in between um the painting or the coloring so what you want to do is you want to fill it up so uh what we're going to do now is we go back to draw again and then now we're going to fill those space like here You're gonna fill it up like that. Okay, we're just gonna quickly fill it up. If you make any mistake, you can just come here and just click back. Okay. Alright, fantastic. So um we've we're done with that. So I'm gonna click on OK and then I'm just gonna bring it down. That's below the outline. Okay, so now that we've done that, the next thing we're going to do is to color the eyes and then the teeth, the lips, and so on. Okay, so I'm gonna click on the zoom icon to remove it. Let's go back and bring this back, okay? Alright. So we're going back to draw again and then now we're going to um click on white because we're, we're going to make the eyes white and then the teeth white also so we're going to click on okay so now i'm just going to zoom in and i'm just going to quickly color the highs Okay, so um, I felt since the yam is somewhat white, I just decided to color it white also. So we've colored the eyes, the teeth, and then the earring. So now we've done that, we're just gonna click on OK. So what I want you to do is I'm gonna come over here and I'm gonna take this down. Okay, take it down like that. Let's bring it down a little again. Just bring it down. Okay, great. Now that we have this, 
so you notice that there's some mistake in the the eyes so i'm just gonna go back to draw again and then i'll just quickly color the eyes again to remove those white spaces all right so okay so now that we've done that the next thing we're going to do is just mainly paint the skin color all right so i click on okay once i click on okay then i'll advise you to lock all these things because you don't want them to mistakenly move while you're working okay so the next thing we're going to do is to um add the skin color so i'm going to click on the pen um the draw icon again i click on the plus icon then I click on the color picker then I'm just going to pick a color for him I'll use this one I think it's okay so I click on okay all right so for now what I'm going to do is just paint just color his face all right that's what we're doing so not to bore you guys again I'm still going to just quickly um color his face like that please and please and please and please if you're watching this video right now please subscribe that is if you are new here and then also like the video please it will mean a lot to me thank you so much if you just did Alright, so you notice that I literally covered every part of his face. That's what you should do also. So um, the next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to click on OK. So now I'm going to come over here. Alright, I'm just going to take this like down, 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 down. Like really down. Yeah, something like that. Okay, so if we remove this, we have this. So um, yeah, so uh, you can just do a little um, adjustment. Maybe you see some mistake or some parts that the colors are not added. Okay, so um, I actually forgot we've not actually painted the lips yet. So for the lips, um, quickly just going to go to draw again. Go to color icon. Okay, and then I'm just going to pick the color of the lips. So yeah. Let me use this or this. Anyone I want to use. Oh, let me just use this one. I click on OK and I'm not going to click it, paint the lips. Okay, so once we have finished everything, yeah, we don't really need this anymore. Okay, we're just gonna quickly delete that. That's the image, the image itself. We don't need it anymore, so we're just gonna delete it since we are done with everything. So what I want you to do now is just add everything. So you're gonna come here, click on here, and then just add everything. So we click on OK and then we're just going to add a simple background. Okay, I'm gonna click on color. I can use this one if I want. You can use any color background you want. So um okay, so yeah, and then once you're done, you can just save. Click over here, click on save as image, and then just save to gallery. So that's how to actually just turn yourself into a cartoon using Pixie Lab application. I hope the video was helpful. If it was helpful, make sure to give it a thumbs up. That's if you did not like the video yet. Please, 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 please help me to like the video. It will mean a lot to me. And then also subscribe to my channel. That's if you're new here. So yeah, thank you guys so much. I will see you guys.
next time.